Hello everybody and welcome back. I'm going to be doing a look for and it's on that look right there. I already did my face. I applied my moisturizer then I used NYC Smooth Skin Facial Primer. And I used the Nikko K High Definition Concealer all over. And I set that with um, my MAC Pressed Powder in Dark. Oh yeah, so it looks like pressed powder. I'll cover the mirror. And that's it. And that's my perfect skin tone, so I don't know how I got dark out of that, but it's a perfect match. And then I contoured a little with another MAC. Well this is a MAC Studio Fix. And this one is in NW50. Again, let me cover the mirror. And see a nice dent in there. Nice dip. Contoured a little. I primed my lids with the Ruby Kisses HD eyelid primer that I had to pot it. And, okay, let's get started. I'm going to use this NYC New York Color Duo, and the name of this is New York City Skyline. It comes like that with a little applicator. And I'll be taking that taupe, I love that taupe, and applying that on my lids. Oh, before that, actually. Hmm. That's right, the first thing I actually did was take this Lumini Duo. And this is in My Dream, I think. Yes, yes, it is My Dream. And this is what My Dream looks like. Take the applicators out. And I'll be using that taupe in my crease. I love taupes. These are one of my favorite colors. I love taupes. Taupe is a brown with a gray undertone. Sometimes it's more gray than brown, but yeah, I love these taupes. They're great for shading, as you can tell, and contouring. Perfect. You know, I wanted to come out here also when I'm doing this and chit chat a bit. Chit chat about advice and constructive criticism. Being careful with both. Because when you give advice, um, let's say on a traumatic experience, but you felt in that traumatic experience that you would like to advise others. On, it's not the same thing they felt if they went through it. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, uh, say, I lived through a house fire when I was a little girl, and I almost perished in this fire. The way I felt may not be the same way you felt if you went through a similar, you know, situation. Fear, yeah. Fear is one of the things we more than likely have in common that we felt, yeah. Few things, but not everything, right? So we're all different. But fear, yeah. That'd be one of those things. That, okay, now I'm going to um, take the New York City Skyline Duo and take the top, that beautiful top. Yeah, and criticism, constructive or otherwise. I notice there's a lot of very sensitive people on here. You have to be very careful. Your intentions may very well be good, but if the person is sensitive or has self-esteem issues, they will take it the wrong way. Trust me on that. A few of you are probably shaking your heads going, mm-hmm. I'm sure a few of you have been gone through that already. Mm -hmm. Just be careful with that. And even the other people in the comments section will attack you 
I haven't been through this, but I've seen, I've seen others go through it. Not seen, well, yeah, I've read it in the comment section. Like, wow. Okay, now I'm gonna take the New York City Skyline Duo again, and I'm gonna take that top shadow, the small brush. Yeah, you gotta be careful with that, you really do. And I'm gonna just pop that right, right there. Tear duct, a little. Just to give it a little light right there. Blend that. Okay, now we have that. I'm gonna take this Revlon Max Single Shadow. And this is in Rich Sable. And that is Rich Sable. It's completely matte. And hmm, I guess I'll take this brush. Should I? <laughs> yes, I should. Okay. And I'm gonna pop that right in the outer corner. The reason why I'm telling you guys about this is because I can't help but notice been happening you know people with good intentions you know believing they're giving constructive criticism and the other party not receiving it well at all then what you're witnessing is an all-out attack you know by the other people and everything so and some people like I said they're just sensitive you know you just gotta be careful you know no one's here to hurt anyone's feelings it's not right. Now I'm going to take this other Revlon Matte Single Shadow. And this is in Vintage Lace. The top broke off this one. And that is Vintage Lace. I'm going to apply that on my problem. That's my highlight. So, you know... You have to consider people's feelings and situations. That's why I always say, I stress it, you know. We don't really know people on here. Like some people say, oh, they know me too well. Nah, no, not really. No, not really. I'm going to blend that out. You know, just when you think you know someone, it'll take one comment to make you realize, hmm. Yeah, I should have been careful with that. I really didn't know her as well as I thought I did. <laughs> exactly. And then this, um, just common sense, you know. Common sense stuff. Stuff you shouldn't really do or say. Or rather. See, I just think before you type. Yeah. I was thinking of um, starting a series, hitting on very serious topics. Okay, now I'm going to take this Revlon Brow Fantasy in Brunette. And do my brows. Yeah, you know, like I said, be careful before you start typing. Because um, not everyone can take constructive criticism, perhaps as well as you can. And not everyone is really receptive to advice, if you know what I mean, you know? Some people just rather not, and you have to respect that. And like, I give advice. That's like, um, second nature to me. I am a therapist. You know, so I, I love helping people. But I know my boundaries, I know my limits. You know? And you don't know really and truly where a person's at mentally. Take a, if you type the words, throw someone in a deep depression or even worse. You never know. I've heard some horror stories being in this field. Just got to be careful with that. So before, you know, your heart may be in the right place. Okay, granted. But before you go playing 
therapist at least do some research or better yet leave it to the professionals you know really I'm not even kidding sometimes you may do more harm than good unintentionally which is the sad part because I'm sure no one here is out to I guess I hurt anyone hurt anyone's feelings there's always that possibility because you don't know what you know most people are going through and where they're at mentally like I said no doubt so yeah that's my stand on that just think before you type we're all humans yes we're similar yet the same we all go through things most times differently because we are different people so and we deal with things differently our own ways you know use the other side just like a brush them out oh before I do that we take the NYC browser which I am so anxious to hurry up and use up what it looks like set that set the gel so yeah I'm, I'm more than sure you guys are to in the right place and your intentions are good just be careful you know because I know you'd feel bad if you offended someone well, with some people that's not hard to do I guess that you don't know where most people are at mentally and I know you guys hear it all the time oh she knows me so well he knows me so well but it would take one comment to make you see how well you didn't know he or she. Mm-hmm. I'm telling you, I've been in this field for years and I've seen, I'm not gonna say I've seen it all, but boy have I seen it quite a bit, you know. <laughs> seen friendships broken up or a simple phrase or sentence of advice. Mm-hmm. So you wanna be careful with that, you know. Okay. Come on. Just a little bit. Yeah, I think that's good. I think I'm taking a walk. It looks like it's gonna rain. So you guys already know. I love that. So that's a um, rich sable. I have quite a few of these Revlon matte single shadows that I got from Deals for a dollar. I got a whole bunch. I also got this from Deals for a dollar. Quite a few of them, the NYC um, duos. So yeah, you know, just like I said, think before you type. Just like you should think before you speak. Yes, think before you type. Okay, now what is next? My beautiful friends. Mm -hmm. I also got this for a dollar. This is the Elf Cream Liner. I did not get it from Deals. I got it from an outside vendor. And this is, um, I think, Espresso Cafe or something like that. And let me take one of my favorite brushes, which is a Boutique Angled Eyeliner Brush. I had a black liner out, liquid liner, but I figured with all these taupes and browns, I really didn't want to go that harsh. So I'm going to line my upper lash line with that cream liner. So yeah, I'm really thinking about this new series. Before I do though, I want to upload a few videos to the Another series I had started, which is with the nails. Mm -hmm. I haven't forgotten about that. I 
do believe I know what video I have up next for the nails. And that series is basically about nail design, fake nails, nail art. Yeah. Okay, and this other duo is by Lumini. I got this for a dollar also. My dream. I found it at a beauty supply store. I have a few of these also. And this is at a beauty supply store, and I just knew I had to pick some of these. These are all matte. These Lumini duos. Okay. Now we have that done. Curl my lashes. The Elf Eyelash Curler. I'm gonna apply mascara to my lashes and it's a shame I don't have brown mascara but the benefit they're real and black because that's what I have. And I'm going to apply one coat to my lashes. I only apply to my upper lashes in this eye so I don't know if I'll do the lower. I doubt it. Because I really do want to go outside. Funny how my lashes look so skimpy without mascara, but that's what mascara does. It <laughs> it enhances your lashes because when you see me without mascara, it sometimes looks like I don't have any lashes. But no, they're really dark, so you can tell. But they look just very short, and I don't have to apply like three or four tubes or five or six coats. One. And I'm done. Very beautiful, right? Okay, now I didn't bring any lip gloss. So, oh. I'm gonna use this Prestige, and this is one of my favorite cosmetics brands from the drugstore. They're a bit crazy on the prices, though, really. It's, <laughs> I usually find Prestige at local beauty supply stores here and there. So, yeah, this one cost me a dollar to lip liner and it's a natural and that is natural unbelievable I didn't grab a lip primer lip conditioner or anything and I typically don't do that but here goes nothing huh <laughs> This formulation is creamy but matte. No shiny, it's completely matte. But it's kind of drying, yeah. Matte, hence it's matte, yeah. How about that? I'm gonna apply this NYC lipstick and this is in Lilac Dream. And this is what Lilac Dream looks like. I'll apply that over that. So, <laughs> a little creamy, but not much. <laughs> uh, but I really enjoy the look of matte lips. It's like old school, vintage feel. Like, I love that. Oh, yeah, on my nails. I am wearing my favorite cosmetics brand of all time, and that is Nika K. And this is in Desert Blush. This is satin, satin metallic. It's a peach with gold undertones, if you can, the camera's catching that. Maybe not so much from the bottle, but from my nails. Now I am going to be taking the GOV palette because I didn't bring a blush. And I'm gonna be using this peach blush right there. I 
also forgot the other brushes, so okay. It's the same brush I used the MAC powders. Right on that contour. And blend it out. That's why I didn't blend out the contour because I do it later with the blush. You guys are having a wonderful weekend. So I just want to take a little walk. Enjoy the rain. Let's see what else. I believe that's it. Brush my hair up. <laughs> washed my hair last night so yeah I have a a video idea for that um, series I have I haven't put nothing up on that um, playlist in a while for the nails so I would like to put at least one one being the least and two being the most on that playlist before I start the new series. So that's it. I'm gonna put on some earrings before we go out. Uh, these are the ones I'm gonna be wearing. Aren't they beautiful? All blinged out, all oh, heads. So we're gonna go out and take a little walk. I like coming on here and chatting with you guys. Husband's not home, so. Well, you can tell. I'm recording, yeah. No, but I do record while he's here. Just not all the time. So I like to spend time with my husband. And these cost me a dollar from the local beauty supply store. Mm -hmm. This is it, we're done. And remember, think before you type. Consider someone's feelings. Also consider that you don't know what state of mind they're in or where they're at, you know, mentally. You don't know. So, but anyways. This is how the look turned out. Toby. I love Toby. Thank you for watching. I do hope you all enjoyed. May God continue to bless you and all your families always. And until the next time, stay blessed, beautiful, and ciao.